Hey guys, Kiss of Frills here, and we're back with some more Sons of the Forest. Right, so after last night's live stream, I have uh, come to the conclusion that we actually need to get some sort of crematorium set up by the wall. Because there's no way of getting the cannibals from the wall all the way over there just so I can cook them. I feel like that is a waste of journey, it is a waste of time, and I'm not doing it. So we've got these two set up on the wall here, and we've got two more spear places down there as well now. They took ridiculously long, but they're up anyway. So I'm thinking maybe we put the crematorium area kind of like just leaning up against the wall here. We could have it attached to the top beams coming down. It's only going to be a small one. I actually mean it this time. Just small. Takes ages to build. And I'm thinking, let me get my stick. Here we go. I'm thinking maybe bring it down here. The roof comes down. We go down by two. We bring it out by like two. We go like three or four wide. And then we can have kind of like storage on the top for uh, bones. Burn them inside. Bone storage on top. Roof covering it. It will look good. I've got an idea. Well, kind of a semi-good idea. And I'm not entirely sure. But the best thing about this, we could just send all the gear from over there to here. We don't have to care. I should have left all the stuff down here whilst I was building. Right, I'll get, I'll get my sledge. They're around here somewhere. And uh, we'll get ourselves ready, really. Get ourselves sorted. Ah, okay. I just noticed. Despite going through the electricity system, it is now no longer working again. It's a bit weird. I don't know what's going on, but all of my lights are off. And none of the electric fence is working. Amazing. Right. Well, it looks like we're putting off the... <laughs> yeah, God. Electricity in this game's bugged as well, is it? Right. So it looks like we're putting off the um, crematorium in exchange for getting the damn electricity to work. Again. I'm going to set up a crap ton of solar panel. And I'll have to go out and see if I can find some wire. Because this is going to take ages. All right, this is well, not the plan for today, but I'm having to rip up the entire floor in the friggin' wall so I can see what's going on with this wire system. Unfortunately, this is not what I wanted to do with the day, but it is what it is. Where is that going? I'm going to take that out. I didn't even do anything. Right, so that... I tell you what, I'm going to rewire the whole bloody thing. I'm going to rewire the whole system. I don't know where all these wires are going. So this one here is the one that's connected to the pole. That's connected to the fence. And this one is connected to that. So why... I'm Now I'm floating. So why is that connected to there? What is that doing? Probably nothing. Unless it's powering the system. I want to... I can't even pick that up. It's not even going to let me take it. Here it is. Well, I mean, I don't know why it keeps making that noise. Like, it's not connected to anything. All right, we'll do that. I'm going to switch that around because that's driving me nuts. There we go. That'll work. I mean, it's in the ground, but it works. <laughs> oh, come on. Stand up, mate. Stop crouching for no reason. Right. I've got a lot of wire. I've been ripping it up from all of my stuff, so... Just trying to get some wire. That goes to that. That goes to that. That goes to nothing. So that needs to go to there. And then this all goes down here. That isn't connected to anything, which is a bit weird. So we can connect that to this one here. This is going to be the main one. There we go. The power's back on. So that's the main column. That's where the main power is going to come from. Power problems, that's what we've got. Power issues. Right, so I think with all them connecting to this one hub down here, that is the main one. That should power all of it. So what's going on inside this room? Well, I mean, that's a lot of... That's a lot of planks. I was throwing them through the wall. You stand really close to the wall. You can just throw them through the wall. Right, I need to figure out where all this wiring's going because I don't know... It's not actually going anywhere... It's not connected to anything. It's just sitting here. That was connected. I connected all that up. I don't know why it's not anymore. If I connect that to that, I can run it through the wall. And connect it to maybe like this one here. Right, so that kicked the power in. No idea why. Yeah, the power was already on. Let's go outside and have a little look. Man... Bloody electricity system. Is it on? 
Ow. Yeah. And yeah. Spotlights are on. I think I'll take the opportunity one more floors up to add some more power to it. Just to get more electricity going through it. Because I need more spotlights down there anyway. Actually, I don't think I'm going to. They're separate systems. So that system runs separate from the one that's further down here. So that one goes into that hole. And I think that one runs the light system on, on the inside of the wall. Yeah, that runs the light system on the inside of the wall. So where's the power coming from for the spotlights up here then? They're on. It must be connected. Yeah, that's on. Uh, that's that side. Right, let's do this one because this is separate. So that will stop there. That is a different power system. Is that on? It's on. As long as it's on. I should just connect it all to one power bank, really. All right, let's get the floor back in place before we get start. All right, put a couple of extra solar panels in. Connected it up. I had a lot of wire just sitting around, like, in beams that didn't even need to be there. I'm going to leave that open so I know where I've got to with the um, solar panel, so I know that I can put more down here. Uh, power problems. One thing, I didn't think the power would be an absolute nightmare. But maybe it's because I was wiring it up rubbish. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I had it all connected quite fine, though. Right. Let's get the rest of the wood. I don't even know where I've dumped it. Oh, it's probably out here. Right. I've left that part open so I know that that's the main beam. And I've left that part open so I know where I've got to. I do need to get lights in here. I really do need to get some internal lights in the walls because it is mega dark. It just looks so much better when it's all lit up. Oh, I can't move. Even with the spotlights outside, it look pretty cool. We can still see, which is nice. And then the walls lit up like that. Which looks good. Right, I'm going to go to sleep. Oh. Hello. What's going on here? Oh, he's just going to casually stand up there on top of an electric fence. Just um, hitting the wall, right? You get your ass down. We'll go all ninja on these guys. Sorry, fellas, but I'm not messing around today. I've got a crematorium to build and I've got nowhere to burn you. It's a shame I can't put him in the sledge. Like, as much as I'd love to just go, right, well, let's bring out your dead, lob him in the sledge, and off we go. But no. No. They just fall off. I can't even send them down a zip line, which would have been nice. Imagine just set a zip line up here, send it down there, burn them. Calvin's walking into a wall. I can't build a crematorium out here because it's a waste of time. But this is where they mainly attack from, so I honestly don't know what the easiest way of doing this is going to be. Oh, I've got an idea. Set up a fire trap, right? What do I need? Uh, one rope, one stick, one bottle of vodka. Uh, I don't have that. Right, there we go. Set up a fire trap, lob them all on it, start the fire trap, set it off. Boom. Formation. There we go. Get them before they all despawn. It's the best I can do. I'm not building like a building out here. I kind of don't want to. There we go. I'm on fire. It doesn't matter. I'll survive. Oh, there was another one. Would he disappear? Did that work? Yeah, that worked. Nice. Right, so... We kind of need a place where we can store all the bones now. Unless I can just put it on the side of the sledge. I'll just keep a sledge here. I'll stick it on that. It'll be alright. Well, at least I can cremate them out here. If they come over here, I'll just drag them down here and just lob them on the fire. That way I can get the bones, fill the sledge up, and then I can just empty the sledge, you know? This is interesting. I'm getting that icon again. Ready? Wood. Stone. Rocks. So if I do that, and then I do... Oh, it's not coming up now. Damn it. It was there, it was there literally just a minute ago. I'll get it in a minute. Maybe if I use it, and then ditch it, will it come up? Ah, uh, it's because I put stone in. The problem is with Calvin. Every time I leave him to go around and just do his own little thing, 
He fills everything up with stone. I know I've done this one, but that one's full of stone as well. Like rock as well, which is mega annoying, Calvin. I don't need it. Right, I'm going to send loads of stuff over. Okay. That's not a bad place to actually send the logs. They come straight down and crash into that. Right. Uh, I'm going to skip this part because I feel like this area, trying to incorporate this into the build, would just be... It's just no point. It would just be an absolute nightmare. So we can bring it across here. I'm in two minds whether I'm going to build it out of stone or just build it out of wood. I think I might have had enough of building out of stone for a little bit. I feel like wood is probably the way to go. But I want to get a lot of bone storage set up because I'm going to need a lot of bone. Well, I'm not going to need a lot of bone. I'm just, I just want a lot of bone. How big am I going to do this? What do we reckon? A three by three? I don't know if that's big enough. We can go for it, though. Ha! Here we go. Boom. There we go. Just recreated it. I am going to see if I can get um, stone on that as well. I wonder if I can triple stack it. I accidentally found that out in the stream. So I've got, I've got rock in the bottom. I've got stone. I've got uh, logs on top. If I get the icon to put stone in it, I'm going to put stone in it too. And I'm going to see how well that goes. And see what happens. Right, so we got that. I'm going to go one up. I'm going to leave the front open. It's going to be open plan. I don't want to make it too big because I kind of need to get more buildings down here. What was that noise? What was that? That crime practice. Oh, crap. That's not crime practice. That is a friggin... How many of them have I got? Alright, okay. For you. Oh, it's stuck to your leg. Bye. Shrugged it off like nothing. No. Crap. Missed. I didn't even mean to push the button that time around. Well, I mean... It did hit him. That missed. Oh, he's angry. He's angry. Come on, turn around. You're a bit slow at turning around, mate. Behind you now. Oh, okay. That was, a, that was a complete turn there. Run around in circles. There's nothing you can do. Screws of his AI. I oh, know you're getting angry with all your arms. Don't worry. It'll be okay now. You'll have peace and quiet. No more pain. Just want your skin. Oh, that look disappeared. Interesting. So the log I put in there just vanished. Okay. Well, maybe we're not screwed with that then. I don't want to lose all my stuff. Right, let's get this. Uh, let's get a rough shape. Wow. Do that again. Let's get a rough... Oh, come on. There we go. Get a rough shape, as I was saying, of how I want this to look. We can go like that. And then I kind of want an upstairs. But I also want a roof on it. Oh, I don't need an upstairs. You know what? We can bring this down to like a... Don't fall off. Come on. Just slides off of everything. Look. Is that... A... That is a Calvin. I thought that was a cannibal for a minute then. I was about to go shoot him, but... It's just Calvin. I still might go shoot him. I'm not sure. Right, let's see what that looks like with a couple of logs on it. Might be a bit high. That looks like it It's not as smooth as I was hoping it would be. Right, let's cut that down by a quarter. Oh, a quarter. There we go. That's better. Ditch that down there. There we go. So we got... Yeah, that'll work. We've got a half half log in there. And I can fill that in. Can I fill that in? Of course not. It's not recognising it for me to be able to fill it in. Amazing. Yep. Uh, it's just what I thought. Obviously, it's not going to work. Never going to work properly, is it? There's always going to be some sort of restriction in the building in this game. <laughs> All right. Uh, considering this is, this is a bit smaller than what I was hoping for, I might go a bit bigger. Uh, I want a lot of storage. That's the problem. So I don't want to bring it out too far. If I bring it out too far, it's going to interfere with whatever I build down there. So I could just stretch it out by another couple. How are we looking? How many wires are that? One, two, three, four, five wide. That'll be the centre. That'll work. Yeah, that'll work. We'll go six wide. It's a, it's a big, 
big bloody crematorium. I don't think I need it this wide, but we shall see. Then we're going to have a couple of areas to build and burn things, and yeah, we'll do that. All right, there we go. I think I've got some sort of an outline. Bit annoying that I've got to put that beam across there, but for some reason it doesn't let you stick a block or quarter log or a half log or anything on top of that when you've got the slope next to it. Bit annoying, I know, but it is what it is and that's what we've got to deal with, I'm afraid. What was that noise? That must be a seagull. Uh, the ramp in and out's a bit steep. Can't really get in it. I don't think I can place a log across the bottom either because it's a... Uh, I don't like a steps, isn't it? No, it's just not going to let me do it. What about if I take all of that out? I don't. I still don't think it's going to let me do it. It's annoying. We'll try. Nope, I think I could do. That's just going to have to stay steep, I'm afraid. It's just a, a big, big step. I keep getting stuck on it, which is mighty annoying. But it is. I don't care. I can't do anything with that. So, it's not, I mean, it's not going to be anything fancy. Not going to be anything fancy at all. So we've got five by two. Uh, let's get the floor in. It'll take a bit of time. I might set a zip line up from up there down to here. So I haven't got to keep running in and out to get the logs. I've got plenty of logs up in the tower. I'll just get them. Right. I'm going to floor this section, but I'm not going to floor that with wood. That part's going to be stone because that's going to be the crematorium part. I'm going to wall it with wood because I I honestly don't want to build out of stone for much more. I've uh, I've done a lot of stuff out of stone. And I just I just want to have a rest from it to be, to be honest. I don't mind building the small part out of stone, but I'm not I'm not doing it all. all right, let's get this in the sledge so we don't lose any of it. I can probably just floor that straight across. Yeah, we can, can do that. I'll get the stone out. Oh, see, look, that's got logs in it as well. I can't trust anything in this frigging game anymore when it comes to the sledge. Some of it's got logs, some of it hasn't. I don't know what's going on. Let's get this propped up. It's just so weird. So weird. Strange bug. Never really seen it before, but now it won't stop happening. There. Probably going to use that for the firewood anyway. Get that across there. Perfect. So get that stoned. And then we can start building some sort of surrounding for it. It's not going to be anything fancy. It's just going to be simple. Right, we can get stone from up here. Bit hard to see because it's dark. But that's kind of what I've got. I just don't want to go to sleep yet. Because, well, it's a waste of time. Snow will come around again and I don't want it to. I'm thinking like this is going to be the fire pit area. I'm going to bring the walls up a little bit. I come, I'm kind of restricted from what I can do basically inside because, well, I'm not ripping down the back wall just to build a crematorium on the side of a building. I'm not, I'm not doing that again. So I might bring that up two, maybe three for the sides and then just single this front part so I can put uh, fires in the middle and start. What do you just pick up and run off with? a bit of a weirdo. I don't know what he's doing. He better not be nicking my stone. If he is, I've just sent it all down here. What a little, little jerk. Crappy little run. Screw you, Calvin. Right, anyway. As I was saying before, I was really interrupted by him. Might bring this up a tad higher than normal. Just, I want it so I can still get in there. Like that for the sides, I reckon. Get one more in there. There we go. Yeah, that looks alright. That's going to be hollow. Yeah, I could probably fill in the sides of that if I get some logs. Of which I don't have any. Never mind. I could probably fill the sides of that in. Might even be able to get a log across there and get stone. You know what? I might just fill that all the way up. Just wall in the sides completely. Yeah, we'll do that. Alright. I slept. I put my pyjamas on. Just because uh, he was knackered. The guy was knackered. Sent over a load of gear. It's now the next day. <laughs> so we're getting this done quite nicely. What I could do is I could cut a window in that. So, nah, there's no point. 
I was going to cut a window in it to make it look a bit nicer, but there's, only, there's honestly no point. It's a crematorium in it. You don't want to be looking in there. Well, I mean, a little window probably would help, but... Fill these in. And then I need to think of something to do with the front. Obviously, it can't be too high because it's only... I've got this beam across, right? So, and that needs to be there. I can't get rid of that. Because obviously, that's supporting the roof. I'll get rid of that. It's not, it's not going to work. It won't support the roof anymore. And then it, it just won't work. Which is annoying. And I can't jump in there because if I jump in there to get the bones, it's... Uh, I'm just going to get... Well, I'll get stuck. Basically. Unless I had a side door where I could just walk in. I mean, that would happen. That would work. I could put a side door in. Actually, that's a good shout. Get a side door in there. I can walk down the side. I can come through here like... And then grab all the bones. I can seal it in properly. I mean, the side door is going to be wood, but... Is he stealing... He's stealing the rocks. He's coming over here and he's grabbing my stone and he's walking off with it. Right, note to self, only put enough stone over so Calvin uh, can't nick it. What? See, he's doing that thing. It's just throwing me out. It's so buggy. <laughs> it's just so buggy. So buggy. Right, anyway, let's get on with this. So that's going to be a wall. That is going to be the front. I'm going to put the door in here so we can come in and grab the bones. I know it's a bit weird, but we need to be able to get in there and sweep it out, don't we? Get rid of all the rest of the trash that's in there. Come on. Right. Uh, stuck. Jesus. Right, that's what I'm looking at. That looks all right. The fires are going to be in there. We can come down here and clear it out when needed. I think I need to get on the roof. Start smashing in some of this roof now. Just to cover it up. And then we need to get the walls in. Okay. That's the crematorium area. Problem is, I don't know if... Wow, I've got two sticks. If I can set the fires up through the wall. We'll go like that. No, don't light it. I need some more... St oh, there's plenty of sticks over here. What's this got in it? Oh, of course, rock. Calvin strikes again. Just turns everything into rocks these days. If there's room, he's filling it with something. I'm not going to fill this completely, but... No. Is that two fires? Is that one? That's one fire. We'll go there. Oh. No. Automatically goes to light it. Slightly annoying. Right, let's take the uh, rock out of this. Oh, let's get them full up. Right, there we go. Three fires set up in there. Now, the question is, can I light it? I can, but I have to crouch. Yeah, that works. I mean, I mean that works, right? This could be worse. All my logs are rolling off. I don't really care at this stage, <laughs> honestly. Right, we need log holders. I'll tell you what, I might build some down here. Put it in there. That's in that one, in it? There we go. Just enough so we can cram it down here and get it full. We're going to get a few of these. Uh, we'll go like that. Well, when I say a few, maybe like two. Let's see if I can get a third in. I don't think I'm going to be able to. Uh, no, two would do. I've got plenty of sticks. That sledge next to me is full of sticks. That's empty. This has got sticks. Nice. Okay, that's that. Got a few loose logs in there. That is built. That is done. Now I need to fill it in. I was, I'm kind of wishing I'd taken out these parts here and turned them into stone, but I'm not going to do that because otherwise I'll have to rip down the ceiling again and get that out. Actually, I might not have to. I might be able to support that and like that and like that. Will that let me take that? It will. That will work. There we go. That works. That's better. Basically supported the corners, ripped out the beams in the center. That works. I don't need that in there. That can come out. And I don't need that one in that side. That will come out. That is a waste of stone. B. Why are you sitting there? I do not know. Just don't want to accidentally hit her with anything. I'm not... Yeah, I'm going to wall in the sides and the building with wood. Can't trust the sledge anymore. Whenever I take something out of it, I always think it's going to ping into something different. Right, so I don't need that. Because I'm 
I think I'm done building out of stone. I'm going to ditch that to one side and then we'll get the... Uh, we'll get it, we'll get the wood down here. We've got plenty of it. Put that there so Calvin doesn't get the great idea of moving it. There we go. Oh, we've got company. Oh, no. Big company. Sorry, guys. I ain't going out there. No way. I should make... A, I can't see through here. It'd be great if I could, but I can't. Maybe I can come out here and do them. Oh, I can. Ah, there's the loud noise of those... Oh, there's another one there. Oh, yeah. That looked like that hurt, love. I, I should get a wall in there. Or like a window so I can actually see through. My God, I'm getting stuck on it. V, go away. I'm getting stuck on everything. It's winding me up. There we go. Shut up. God, those things are so friggin' noisy. Wish you could, like, control the audio on them. These are the big ones. So I'm going to have to get real careful with these ones. Oh! Ho, ho! What a shot! Okay, yeah, I got a hot hit. But, my God, that was a good shot, you got to admit. Right? Proper jumped through the air and hit me just as I shot it. That was good. There we go. Let's shut that up. Perfect. Oh, well. That didn't last long. Glad I got the electricity back up and running. That would have been horrible. Ah, spear traps aren't very effective against them ones, I'm afraid. But what I am going to do is cremate them. Bloody cannibals now. Oh, that's... Uh, I don't want to use them. That's Buckshot. Are you coming? Yeah. You're going to run away? No, I thought not. I thought not. Don't worry, though. That's it. All burn. All burn. Barbecue for everybody. There we go. Loads of bones for me. Lovely barbecue for them. Amazing. Right, to be fair, this is going up actually pretty damn quick. Why is there a... I'm not even going to question it. I had to fill in the top around there. Because I, um, I couldn't... Because uh, it looked stupid, basically. And I had to put these in here because I couldn't get up there. Too short. Should be okay now. I can remove them. I don't need that. I need to fill this part in. Get that in there. I don't care so much about wood. Wood is easy to get. Stone, not so easy. I'm not going to be able to fill in the top of this part completely. I don't even know I'm going to be able to get... Oh, nailed it. That means I should be able to just... There we go. I can do it from down here. I can't bring it all the way up. I can only do it to a certain... Is that another fall? That's a fall log rolling off. I'll go get that in a minute. There we go. I'm going to have to leave a little gap up there. I can't... I can't fill it in. It just goes through the roof and it looks stupid. So I can't do that. Um, that door, though, I am going to lock because I don't want Calvin and Virginia walking through the damn thing. Because that's the sort of thing they'll do. They'll just walk straight in it. Well, that's not bad. That is not a bad crematorium. The only problem is I have got nowhere to store the bones. Maybe outside. I could bring this along and just put it into a... Like a bone storage. That would work, I suppose. What about down here? Can I bring that along? Can I floor that, though? That's the question. I can floor that. And I can floor that. But it's kind of slanted. I think that might look a bit rubbish. Yeah, it's going to look crap. Uh, can't bring that up either, I don't think, because it's stairs. If I put that across... That, oh, I can. I could bring that side up, but not... Oh, I can. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, we'll just do it that way then. That was good, wasn't it? Oh, I'll have to go get some more wood. Uh, Yeah, that works. <laughs> well, I didn't think that would work. Right, let's go get some more wood. All right, let's tidy this up a tad. There we go. Yeah, that looks all right. That doesn't look too bad. That can be chopped up into firewood. Yeah. That looks all right. I kind of like that. I'm going to have to give it like a little ramp in and out. Otherwise, that's going to suck. But that should look fine. I'm going to have to head out to the trees in a second and grab some more wood. But Or not, because that worked. 
Um, not going to give it any railings. I'm just going to leave it as is, I think. Right, let's cut that down. I could get quite a few bits of um, bone holders in there. Stitch that over there. Let's get that into firewood. There you go. I think that looks better. So giving it a little bit of railings going on there. Actually looks quite nice. Much better. Yeah, I like that more. Right. It's not much storage room, I'm afraid, though. Uh, I'm going to have to... I didn't want to extend it any further. I didn't want it going down like the whole wall when I can't have an upstairs. See? Bloody logs are just rolling off everywhere. There we go. That's looking pretty good. I like that. All right, we don't need that now. I've got loads of firewood out. Rounded up all of my loose bits and used them. I've got bone holders down here. Which is fine. I know I filled it all up, but we could just run across the top of them. It's absolutely fine. I don't need that there anymore. As far as I know, I'm not placing anything else down here. Inside's all lit up. Got ourselves some lights. Got ourselves the door to get in and out. See what it looks like when we light the fires. There we go. Oh, that looks good. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that looks real good. All right. Yeah, I think that looks good. We do need to see if we can get some more... Um, Bone holders in. I might be able to get some down the back wall, but I feel like I'm probably gonna get stuck on them. And I'm already getting annoyed because I keep getting stuck on these corner bits. I might have to swap them out for stone. But I could just increase this along a few and build some stone uh, bone storage there once that area gets full. But at least we've got a little crematorium area now, which is needed. So yeah, I'm going to leave this one here. So thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more, subscribe. Also, I've got Discord links in the description. Feel free to head over and say hi. And if you feel like showing me a bit of extra support, you can. I've got a Patreon page. Link is also in the description. It's very much appreciated. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for coming. Bye.